All right, so in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to add amazing effects to your photos. You can convert this photo into this, or you can convert this photo into this or this. Highly artistic, let's dive in. Hey guys, Sock here from Socky Tech, and in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing a powerful little feature for the Samsung Gallery application that is extremely fun to use. So let's dive in and get started. I do wanna give a quick shout out to my man over here on Twitter, Mr. Sarkar, for bringing this to my attention. Anyway, let's dive in. So the first thing you do wanna do is you wanna make sure you have the latest version of the Gallery application. To get the latest version, very easy, Click the link down below. It's going to take you to my website. Once you're at the website, you want to scroll down just a little bit. Under download, you want to click link number two. You click this link, it takes you to the store. And if you're not up to date at the bottom, it's going to say update and you are going to be good to go. Now, let me show you this fantastic feature. So let me launch the gallery application. Uh, here, I have a couple of examples of what you can do. So here's the original photo. What I can do with this feature is I can turn this into this if I want to. Look at that, it's beautiful, all right? Or I can turn it into this or this. Look at that, beautiful, okay? This is a built-in feature in the gallery application. And here's another example. This is one of my daughters right over here. I can convert that into this photo absolutely amazing one more example before i show you how to get it done here's a car look how it looks uh in this instance so here's how you do it and there's also a little secret feature that is attached to this feature so first let me show you how to get it done so you tap on the photo that you want to modify you tap on edit all right and then on the top you tap on the three dots and then you go into style once you're in the style you can pick from all these options you have the color pencil you got this guy right here, you got the watercolor, you've got the blue ink, okay? And by the way, if you do pick one of these options, you can actually uh, change the intensity as you please, okay? Now, there's also a hidden feature in relation to this feature. By the way, once you're done, just to be clear, if you click save, it's gonna override the original photo. So you wanna tap the three dots and you wanna tap on save copy so it doesn't override the original photo and you get this saved separately. That's the reason I have the original photo and the modified version. Now, if you are using a human being, you get a secret feature. So what happens is you tap on edit, all right? So you tap on the three dots and you go to style. Now, when you do this, let's pick one of these guys. Let's just pick this one right here. At the bottom, you're gonna see another button next to the slider. Okay, it's gonna be shape of a human. When you click this, you can actually retain the original person's photo and just have the background differ or tap it again. Now the background is the original background and this is the effect. Or I can tap it like this and I can do the whole thing. So cycle through the whole thing as you please. You can do this anybody, you can do it with yourself, whatever, okay? But the great thing is, uh, you can create some amazing avatars using this for yourself or anybody that you want. Absolutely fantastic. Uh, again, thank you to Sarkar for bringing this to my attention. If you do have any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. Let me know for now, guys. Have a fantastic day, all right? All right, so if you found this video useful, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech by clicking that button and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Socky Tech Online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.